guys welcome back to the channel or welcome if you're new here my name is sarah and today we are starting part two of our legacy let's play series which we are currently in chestnut ridge so this is a little bit of a horse ranch let's play series and the goal for this series in case you guys missed the last episode is actually to build up this legacy family and make this beautiful winery as well because we are on the 64 by 64 lot that isn't going very well. Actually, right now, Johnny Zest is in the shower. He had some needs he has to take care of. I need to cook something for him. But we aren't making a whole lot of money. We're down to 19 simoleons, and our apples and grapes are actually out of season, so I can't get them to grow. And so it's not going well. I think today's goal is going to be just to make enough money that we can enclose a little area over here to kind of be like a greenhouse. And we will change it, of course, as soon as we can. But right now, I desperately need some apples and grapes. So I think that's what we're going to do. But first, Johnny does have to eat really quickly. So I'm going to let him take care of that. Also, as I left you guys, Johnny was fishing. We did manage to catch one fish, and that's it. So we are gonna sell that and it's not very much money, but we're gonna sell it. And then I found a few collectibles that we can sell as well. And hopefully, I don't know, hopefully we'll have enough to maybe make another batch of nectar or build a greenhouse, maybe. One of those things. But I think I'm gonna sell all of this stuff. It doesn't even matter what it is. I think it's all gotta go because we are broke and hopefully we can make a little bit of money off of this. Oh, that fossil's good. Let's see. It's a rare. I kind of hate to sell it because it's rare, but I think we're going to have to because it's worth 250. I wonder if that would be enough to build a greenhouse. <laughs> I'm just going to jump into build mode and see if that is possible. Walls are actually 60 simoleons, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that, but we could also sell that nectar press that we ended up not needing. I wonder how much we could get for that. 108. We'll sell it. And let's see if we can build a very small greenhouse. We can't. We can't do it. Okay, we need more money. We gotta figure out how to get some more money. I think we'll just start making nectar and right now we'll just have to buy the apples and then hopefully, hopefully soon we'll stop making poor nectar and we can actually afford to do this. But right now we're just gonna make another batch of apple nectar and hopefully it will turn out good okay so johnny is working on that apple nectar for us and then we have this bottle of apple nectar that we made when we were play testing it's worth 27 simoleons but it hasn't aged yet so i've kind of been waiting on it to age to see if it's worth a little bit more because right now it's not even worth what we paid for the apples so maybe this batch will be a little bit better okay let's see what we got for that one Okay, that one's worth $55, 55 simoleons. Is that more than we paid for it? I think it is. I think it's actually worth more than we paid for it. So should we just sell this one? It's normal quality, that's good. That's very good, Johnny, very good. We actually really do need to go to sleep though, I feel like, so maybe we're just gonna send her home. And then we need to eat this last little thing we got from the neighbors. And then we have to start cooking our own food, which we don't have a lot of money for that but it's okay it's okay we're gonna make our greenhouse we're gonna get our greenhouse and then it's gonna be a lot better but i don't know if i should wait on this apple nectar to age or not because i don't know how much of a difference it makes i think right now i'm actually gonna sell the poor quality one and that gives us 27 simoleons so i think he just put his plate back in the inventory so we'll fix that again and then tomorrow we will have to either go back to the bar and get some more chips or we'll actually have to cook food. So let's go to sleep tonight though because it's 10 o'clock. And then hopefully something will start growing. Maybe we could get some more green beans or some more prairie grass or something. I need something to grow. Oh, it looks like the prairie grass is starting to grow. So that's very good. All right, Johnny, it's morning time. Let's get up and take care of your needs really quickly. And... I guess we're gonna have to oh we could have a quick meal maybe those don't cost money we could have chips here oh okay we'll have chips here because they worked really well in the last episode 
at helping Johnny with his hunger. So maybe that'll work. And we actually have some growth on our apples and grapes. They are actually growing now. They're just going very slowly. And our green beans are, oh, we have more green beans. This time, I'm not gonna sell them all though. I'm gonna plant more of them because I need more. I need more. And I think it was a mistake to sell them all last time because I think it would have been better off if we had actually planted more of them and that way I could have sold more of them. I think that's the solution to our problems. That's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna let Johnny eat and then we're gonna harvest the green beans and get to planting. We're gonna harvest, let me find our inventory. Oh, we got eight of them. Okay, so I'm gonna plant four of them, I think. Should I plant them all? I think I'm gonna plant them all. I mean, we're desperate for money. Hold on, Johnny, don't leave. We're gonna plant these green beans. I think this is gonna be really good. I think that if a batch of these sell for $56 and now we have nine of them, I think we're gonna be doing pretty good now. And then we can build our greenhouse and then we don't have to buy all of our uh, produce for nectar making. <laughs> This is actually turning out to be a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. And I think I'm going to take this nice bottle, or no, it's not nice. It was a normal quality bottle. I'm going to actually put it down here. I probably should only keep the high quality ones, but we'll see. We'll see as we go along. Right now I'm going to put it down there and see if I can wait long enough for it to age this time. But we're also going to harvest all of the prairie grass as well and see if we can make some money that way or see if we can get something else out of it. We got a carrot. That's good. That's great news. Now we can plant a carrot along with our green beans. Don't eat it, just plant it. Oh, we got another carrot. Oh, this has been very successful. We did not get a third carrot, but that's okay. And then once again, we can definitely still not afford a horse. So I think I'm gonna sell this. It's only worth 24 simoleons okay we're gonna sell it anyway because it's you know what we, we we can't get a horse right now so it's fine even johnny even johnny knows he's like sell it sell it we cannot afford a horse we can't even afford anything but we may be getting closer to being able to afford a greenhouse we have 487 simoleons now fishing wasn't super productive for us so i don't know if i want to go back and try to fish more i kind of just want to wait on these two grow but we actually could just sell I'm gonna sell this bottle and then we'll just make another batch so we'll just make another batch because this bottle is actually worth oh we have to clean it clean nectar maker okay I'm gonna sell this one though and our nectar skills should be getting better and better as well which should mean that we can make more and more money so Hopefully we are on the right track now. We're doing good now. It was a rough start. It was a very rough start. We still can't afford our greenhouse, so it's kind of still rough, but right now I think we're doing better. Ah, oh, we got another bottle. Oh, this one's poor again. We went backwards instead of doing better. We went backwards. Okay, it's okay. I have to let Johnny eat because I'm not really feeding him enough. He's just having to eat chips every single meal, and so he's staying pretty hungry. I feel like I'm wasting so much money buying all the apples, but I don't I don't have a choice right now because I can't get them to grow. We're back at it. We got another batch. Let's see how much this one's worth. It's poor again. It's another poor quality nectar. And it's also all the nectar making is making Johnny smell. So I'm going to have to let him take a shower. It's just really not going well, the nectar making situation. Maybe we could actually do an odd job and see if we can make some money that way. Let me see if I can do that. Cause I've, I haven't actually used those before, so I don't know what to do, but we'll give it a, we'll give it a go and see what we can do. Could go be a sand sculpture judge. It says it starts at 2 p.m. on Tuesday, which is right now, but I'm not actually sure what to do. Oh, okay, he's just gonna go. Our green beans are coming along really well. So when Johnny gets home, then we're gonna be doing better. We got a hundred and five dollars. We viewed fancy sandcastles and Had a good day. So we made a hundred and five simoleons. Okay, we're getting pretty close to being able to build our greenhouse But not yet. We're not there yet, but I'm gonna let Johnny have some fun Because he's been working pretty hard and our green beans should be ready tomorrow. I feel like 
after we go to sleep, I feel like the green beans are going to be ready. And then that's going to make us a good amount of money. Then I'm confident that we can build our greenhouse. It's actually probably a good time for Johnny to go to sleep now because it's nighttime. And clearly nothing is happening with our gardening very quickly. But like I said, I think by tomorrow, maybe after he sleeps, I think we'll be able to harvest some more. And then we'll be doing pretty good. I wonder if carrots are out of season. They're out of season as well. Oh, so I have them over here. There's no, they can't even do anything. Let me move them. Oh no, that mattress is not good. Johnny's uncomfortable and he's hungry. I probably should actually let him eat something <laughs> other than potato chips. Um, let's do, we could do some eggs and toast. I think we can afford that. I'll let him cook some eggs and toast. And hopefully the oven will not catch fire because we cannot afford that right now. But we will update, we'll upgrade the bed when we can. But right now we can't. So <laughs> it's going to be a sore back for a while, Johnny. Oh no, it is a fire. It did. <laughs> I did. That's the last thing we need. You have to extinguish it. Oh my gosh. Oh, I have to call. I have to extinguish myself. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's going to cost us a lot of money. Oh no, we got 294 as a insurance payment. I, that won't even replace it. And we need the oven. I'm gonna have to replace it. Or am I? I could just build a greenhouse. It destroyed our counter too. That was not worth eggs and toast. We should have just eaten chips. Thankfully our green beans have grown though. So that's good at least. But he's very tense and he's very upset. I would be too. I get it. He's got to take a shower because he got set on fire. He's scared. I would imagine he's pretty scared. Let's see if we can extinguish fire. We already did that. So we can't do that again. He's hiding under the bed. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Okay, we're going to get nearly 500 simoleons from the green beans. That's very good. That's a good start. Okay, I feel so much better now. And maybe now we can afford a greenhouse and fixing our counter. But first, we're going to do the greenhouse, just in case. Let's see if we can put it right here. Okay, and I can't actually place windows right now, so we are going to have to just use the same stuff that we have on the house. And I think I read that you can delete the floor so that it's a dirt floor, and then you don't have to use planter boxes. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do, I think this was our apple. And we'll put our grapes in here. And then the carrots don't really matter other than making more money. So I am going to put them in there, but that's not really important. And just because it's bugging me a little bit, I'm going to get the dirt wallpaper and put that on there, even though I know it doesn't really make sense, but <laughs> it makes me feel a little better. And we might should put a light in there as well. And we'll research the green beans as well, even though I don't, I don't really know what that does. I don't really know what Johnny's doing right now. I told him to research the green beans and it's taking a minutes I don't think that was worth the time it spent to actually research those green beans I really don't think that was worth it oh here's some stuff about the nectar though that I did not realize was here maybe it was worth it after all because it actually says aging leave the nectar bottle unopened to let them age well that's what we were doing positive effects are enhanced and negative effects are reduced Nectar bottles gain maximum simoleon value when they reach finely aged. Nectar will age faster if stored in a basement or cellar or significantly faster if stored in a nectar rack. So that's what we need. We're not replacing the oven. We're going to get a nectar rack. 300 simoleons, but it's fine. It's worth it. It's worth it, but now we only have 180 simoleons left. But I think with the green beans now, we've got a good thing going. Like every day when they get to where they can be harvested, if they give me 500 simoleons or around that, that's really good. And as we can evolve them and stuff like that, they'll be worth more. Oh no, Johnny has developed a fear of fire now. Oh my goodness, I don't blame him, but how do we get rid of it? Okay, from now on, I'm not selling any more bottles of nectar unless they're poor quality. And everything's gonna go right in here to where it can age and make us some more money. That's the goal now is to just focus on nectar making and green beans. Who knew that green beans were gonna be so important to this family, but they are. Okay, we got our bottle. It's another poor bottle, but I don't even care. 
I'm so excited about our nectar make our nectar. It's not a nectar maker. I'm so excited about our nectar storage rack that I'm putting the pour bottle in there. I don't even care. Now we have one bottle in our nectar storage, and I guess I really need to wait on some actual produce because I'm wasting so much money buying the apples. I just don't really feel like it's ever gonna happen though. I feel so bad that I started this let's play in summer and I'm causing myself so many issues. Everything does not seem to be going Johnny's way at all lately. It has been bad news after bad news. People keep saying you never know until you try but never talk about how it feels after trying something new and it not working out. Johnny can't take another disappointment. It's terrifying and too painful to try again. Oh my goodness, have we developed another fear? Fear of failure we have. We're not going to fail, Johnny. We're going to make this into the best winery that we can. Let's go harvest some prairie grass and get his mind off of a failure. And then we may go back to the bar because his social meter is getting pretty low again. Oh my goodness, our greenhouse looks so sad. It definitely needs some work. Okay, we're at the Rusty Horseshoe, which is the nightclub. We just need someone to talk to and hopefully Johnny will not buy drinks today because we cannot afford them. <laughs> we can technically afford them, but we can't actually afford them. Okay, let's go give a howdy introduction to these people. Okay, I'm gonna let Johnny just chat and hang out at the nightclub for a little while and get his social meter up and I think that's a good place to stop the episode today. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. It's still moving pretty slow, but hopefully our green beans are actually going to save us. And they're going to help us make some more money and get really good started. I feel like once we start making money, it's going to seem really easy. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you think down below in the comments because I always love hearing from you guys. And hopefully we will talk soon with another episode. But thanks so much for hanging out with me today during this one. And I hope you guys are all doing really, really well. But that's it for today, so bye guys. Oh no. Uh,